Hi everyone, welcome to our second episode of Preparing Your Puppy for His First Grooming. Kirby is here with us again today. Yesterday, we brushed half of Kirby. The important thing is you are preparing your puppy for it to be a pleasant experience at their first grooming. Suggest is that you make a trip to see the groomer. Go in, see the shop, talk to the groomer, ask the groomer, can I bring Kirby in to meet you? You really want to work with a groomer who is using positive methods, who wants Kirby to come in and sit on his or her table and be fed some treats, told how wonderful he is, maybe run a brush through him a little bit and then go home. That way, Kirby says, oh, that's kind of fun. That's why I've been feeding Kirby his dog food. We haven't really started anything with him, so we're just doing dog food. So this is how Kirby's getting part of his lunch. If you don't have a grooming table, that's okay. Actually, you can sit on the floor with your puppy, feed them lots of treats, and you can brush their dog. But if you have a dog, a long-haired dog, a golden doodle, a labradoodle, a wheat and terrier, a Maltese, a Shih Tzu, a Cockapoo, a, you know, I could go on and on and on. If your puppy has long hair, your puppy needs to go see a groomer about every four to six weeks. So you want to make it be a pleasant experience. So we're here with Kirby. This is about his fourth time on the table. We've been sitting on the table just feeding him, just to help Kirby think that it's fun. This is how Kirby's getting part of his lunch. There are different brushes that you can use. This one is the, the slicker. Kirby the bowl of chicken there so he can eat his chicken. This one is a nice little brush to get all the way through. You can brush up. Should be a really light brush so that you're not raking the skin. Just a little brush. This one is great for a short haired dog, but not so much for a dog like Kirby. And then we comb. We know we have all the tangles. I groom dogs for 30 years. I've had my own shop. I've had my own business. I know, do it quickly. So, but you can do just a little bit at a time. You don't have to do the whole puppy. So you see, this is how Kirby's been getting his lunch. So we don't give him a lot of extra calories. If the groomer you choose will let you bring him in, let him sit on their table, that's the groomer I would choose. Kirby loves his kibble. And you see, what I'm doing is I'm combing his feet while he is eating his kibble. He's learning that touching feet is good. Touching his body is good. If you don't have a table, you can take a firm surface and put a uh, bath mat. That works nicely for your uh, puppy. But I think Kirby looks nice and fluffy. Look how nice he's standing. If you have an electric toothbrush at home, just turn that electric toothbrush on. If your puppy's not on a table, it can be when your puppy's across the room. You wanna get your puppy used to the sound. Now I have a Dremel here, I'm gonna turn it on. And while I am turning on the Dremel, I'm gonna let Kirby eat the food. It's on low, giving Kirby the rest of his lunch. I'm gonna start touching the Dremel you can do this with an electric toothbrush. What are we doing? We're getting him used to the clippers. If the groomer is going to Dremel, instead of cut his nails, if we get him used to the Dremel. We're gonna turn it on high, just for a minute, and turn it back. That was a little high for him. So you see how he stopped? We want him to just ignore it. Very nice, good puppy. If you have an electric toothbrush at home, hold it far away from your puppy and feed him or have somebody else feed him so that your puppy knows that the sound of the electric toothbrush means food. Oh, good puppy. He's just so good. I know. He's so Thank you for watching Diamond Dog Training. Watch the first video on preparing puppy for his first grooming where you will see Kirby on the table a thank you to Kirby and to Heath, who let Kirby become part of this video. Kirby's doing great. Ring the bell so you receive all the episodes. Bye from Joyce and Kirby at Diamond Dog Training. Bye-bye.